What's going on YouTube? We just wrapped up a little 10K run for the boys. Now I'm about to take you guys through a full day of eating at the start of an eight week mini cut. I'm about 14 pounds overweight. I'm actually starting an eight week mini cut today. So I figured I'd take you guys through a full day of eating to show you how I'm actually kicking off this cut. Now that 10K took a lot out of me. So I figured I'd start with a heavier meal for meal one, which is my infamous egg rice, which I'll use about five grams of butter just to grease the pan. Um, I usually start off at like medium heat. Then I'll take my rice, which by the way, should be day-old rice, okay, preferably cold. Um, here I use 200 grams, and that's typically what I do for my egg rice. Put it into the pan, let it sit, um, try and flatten it all out so that everything warms up evenly. Once it's warm, I'll drop it down to low heat. I'll bunch it all, put it into a corner, slap a little bit more butter um, onto the pan. Like I use five grams collectively. Um, then I'll turn it back to medium heat, throw my eggs into the pan, Slap a couple cranks of pink salt, um, kosher salt or, or sea salt is fine, but I use pink salt. Then I'll throw a couple cranks of black pepper and I'll mix my egg. Okay, like I lightly scramble it, let it sit for a little bit. Once the egg is about like, I'd say like a quarter of the way cooked, halfway cooked, I'll actually flip the rice into the egg and start to mix it all together on low heat. You have to turn it down to low heat at this point. Um, and then I'll usually mix until there's no more white rice visible and the whole like pan is yellow, okay? And I'll finish off with some fresh chives just to add a little bit of flavor and some color to this meal. And to top it off, a little bit more pink salt. So that is my infamous egg rice. Um, you can see the calories and the macros right here. Now you can adjust them to your liking, but this meal has been an absolute staple for me. So I hope you can enjoy it too. And for meal two, I decided to make some pancakes. So I use Kodiak cakes. This one specifically was blueberry. I used a cup, then a three quarter cup of 2% um, white milk, a whole egg, 50 grams of blueberries. Mix that all in threw some butter into the pan. This was five grams as well. If you notice, I don't cook with much oil. I use a lot of butter. Uh, but anyways, threw my pancake mix in, flip, flip, and topped it all off with some 100% maple syrup because I don't like using um, fake syrup. I'd rather the real sugar. And of course, it was weighed for precision. That's 25 grams. And you could see the calories and macros for the full meal on the screen. Now it was a heavier meal, but I knew I had a heavy workflow and I wouldn't eat for a while. So I chose to have this as meal two. Meal three was more of a snack. It was just some homemade chicken soup and I'll put the calories and the macros on the screen here. Meal four was also a snack. I was craving something sweet and I usually have the munchies later at night. So I decided to have some frozen mangoes and a protein shake. And that concludes a full day of eating on my eight week mini cut or to start my eight week mini cut. Um, I actually finished off just, well, after I finished the sandwich, I'm gonna be just under 2,300 calories at 141 grams of protein, 271 grams of carbs and 66 grams of fat. So if you guys have any questions about um, the types of brands that I used or how I cooked any specific meal, just leave it in the comments and I will see you in the next one.